Big news from Cyberlander. Joe Justice is coming to Texas. Yeehaw! <laughs> hey y'all, it's Dr. Nodal. So first of all, I finally found a use for <laughs> my cowboy hat that lives on my set. It's generally right behind me, so you don't notice it, but it's there. Uh, it's, oh gosh, <laughs> long story about that one. One of these days, if you guys are interested, I will actually do a little thing about all of those tchotchkes that are back on my set because there's a story to each one of them. But anyway, on to the big news today. This is just a brief announcement, but stay tuned either tomorrow or Saturday for what I'm hoping will be a chat with some of the key players in this story. Well, first of all, what's happening? Lance King, CEO of Cyberlander, actually contacted me a couple of days ago and told me that Joe Justice is going to be king of Agile at Cyberlander starting very, very soon. And of course, I was not allowed to talk about it until the official press release went out. So I've had to bite my tongue for the past couple days. This is incredible news for Cyberlander, for Joe Justice, and honestly, just a little bit for me. So let's start with Cyberlander and I'll leave a link to their website underneath if you're interested in them. They're creating a pop-up camper that goes on the back of a Cybertruck and it fits in the bed of the Cybertruck. It includes a kitchen, a bathroom, a shower, and sleeping quarters, and it's all powered by AI. It's really an amazing piece of tech. A few months ago, back in April, I did a video with Lance King, who's the CEO of Cyberlander, where he actually showed me around an engineering prototype and the kind of things that they're doing, and I'll leave a link to that up here and at the end of the video. But anyway, it's an amazing company, and the really cool part is that the Cyberlander camper is just the first of a much longer product line, and while I'm not privy to all all of their plans being from the outside, of course, they have an amazing array of things that I know that are coming in the next several years. So it's a really, really cool company. I think they have a very Tesla-like vision for changing the way that people live, and it's incredibly exciting to see that they're getting Joe Justice on board with them. So second, who is Joe Justice? If you don't know who he is, he is sort of the king of agile, and I believe that's going to be his title at Cyberlander, which is absolutely perfect. But basically, he and a number of people in the last 20, 25 years or so have created and evangelized the agile method of manufacturing. It started in the software business where the idea was instead of creating these gigantic monolithic entities and planning them for long periods and then executing them over a long period of time, you start doing things more and more and more rapidly. And at first it was sort of like every three months and then it was reduced to every month. And now Tesla has taken it to the incredible extreme of like almost daily, they're making changes to what's going on. And if you don't know, Joe Justice actually worked for Tesla for a period of time a few years ago. And since then, he's actually been consulting very, very successfully. He has a very full plate. So it's amazing that Cyberlander was able to pull him away from the world of consulting and travel and the glamour and all of that kind of stuff and have him settle down in Austin, Texas, where Cyberlander is based. Coincidentally, since Tesla is also based out of Austin, Texas. So yes, Joe and his lovely wife are going to be moving to Austin and he is going to be taking over as the head of Agile to go from the engineering to the production stages and to make everything more lean, more agile, make the production ultra fast, ultra efficient and ultra flexible. So that's really, really incredible news. And finally, on a personal front, I'm really excited to know that Joe and his wife are moving to Texas. That's only one time zone away now instead of five. So that's really, really cool. And since they're an absolutely lovely couple and Joe is one of the most enthusiastic, positive people that I've ever met, I'm excited to be able to see him more frequently now because I live closer to him. So that's really good news for me as well. Anyway, this is huge news from Cyberlander and I wanted to be able to briefly talk about it today. And again, stay tuned because because in the next couple of days, I hope to release a longer video with a whole bunch more details. In the meantime, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.